Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a, another series of videos decorating my next Traveler's Notebook. I am actually almost done with the one that I feel like I literally just filmed videos of. Uh, I will probably be done with that one uh, in the next couple weeks, maybe sooner. So I'm going to start on decorating my next one. So this uh, journal that I'm going to be using next is a Webster's Pages, um, just standard size, I believe. Uh, so I don't know. I am definitely going to get started on this. So I'm going to do it the same way I did it last time. If you watched the other ones, I'm going to do it in four videos. So I'll do. Um, I counted, so it's going to be eight pages in each video, and I am going to be stickering. So let's see, let me get this out. Okay, so I'm going to do what I did last time, where if I have a bunch of similar stickers, I'm going to kind of skip pages in between so that they're scattered about. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to use up these princess ones first because, I mean, they're the page that's up there first. Um, it's a page on top of my stack. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that. Go ahead and grab some other stickers to use as like bases, kind of. And if you haven't seen the other videos, I literally just kind of stick things wherever I feel like it. <clears throat> stick and plonk. I have some of these, like, vellum strips. That I can use add a little something something. Probably should have started with the page that was already started. <laughs> That's okay. Let's see what I've got in this sticker book. I'm just looking for different textures and finishes and stuff. Like clear stickers with opaque stickers and you know, that type of thing. I'm actually going to call this page done and then I'm going to skip a page and let's see. So I like starting with my largest stickers first. Strips down. And then put some flowers over it there. Flower there. Let's put one of these other little puppies up here. Of these 
pineapples in here. Let's see if I can find any other. Base stickers. Let's see. I'll put that up there with flower and this bikini, maybe. I don't want them to be too crazy busy to start off with because what I found that I was doing with the other journal that I decorated was um, when I had just a few stickers left on a sheet and I just kind of wanted to use it up, I would flip through to a page I wasn't journaling on. Um, so while I'm journaling, I use smaller stickers to fill gaps and stuff and add more details. What I found that I was doing was I was going and taking those extra few stickers on a sheet and just plonking them on a sheet I wasn't writing on yet to get the sheet done. So I think not making it too, too busy, at least some of them, um, is going to be a good thing. Let's see. So for now, I think that's going to be done. I probably should have counted the pages. Let's see. So one, two, four. Five, six, seven, eight. So let me get a little sticky note and I can put that there so I know that that's the eighth page. right in the middle because that is what I feel like doing there and let's use that there and let's use this script it says less Monday more summer and I put that on crooked but I really don't care and I'm going to put this one. It's a little person fishing. And then I'm going to put sun, please. Sun, please. And da -da. let's see. There's a little sleeping mask there. A bow, a paw print, and another little bow. Let's see, I'm gonna need some more like larger stickers that I can use as anchors. those ones. Let's put a little watermelon here. And I think I'm going to use this banner that says party. Oh, that actually fit perfectly. And pineapple. And let's just go ahead and finish this off. Put the bikini there. 
Yay, our first page done. I'm going to go ahead and put some of these vellum strips. Just right in the middle of her legs is fine. I mean, that's the good thing about them being vellum is I don't have to worry, worry too much about covering what's under there because, you know, it's... film so I'm gonna start grabbing some other stickers because I literally have one sticker left on that princess sheet so more pages and I will use the last little princess which is Ariel and now that page is done cool and let's see here I've got this page that I want to finish up none of these are really like larger pieces so I'm going to try to use some of these. Or did I grab some like more anchor type bits? I mean kind of, but... Sure, let's see this. Got some giant food here. <laughs> let's put the donut. And... some trolls. I'm gonna do this one that says don't be smug. Hello, oh, don't be smug. Let's see. Best day. Put that over there. And I need some kinda smaller ones. Let's see. Actually, you know what? I wanted to pull in these ones. These flowers that are in my... Um, planner Stash Busters. I figured I'll just use them in my journal. And it'll be fine. Could this page? 
they would use a little some some mm. this one could and save this one So this page is done. This trolls page is done. Put this hamburger here. The queen of hugs right there. I've got one more name tag. So I am going to color this side, or not color, um, decorate this side. Oh my goodness, my brain's on coloring apparently. There. So I am going to use these larger flowers as like anchor points just like I would with other ones because they are so large they kind of just, you know, look. So... Some different shapes. Let's get these circles. And I think the next sheet I'm going to focus on is this trolls sheet. So Did I use that sheet up? I did, but where'd it go? Am I going crazy here, you guys? Where did the other sheet of these go that I just had? There was like one, oh, there it is. Oh my goodness. I can't even with myself. Literally one sticker left on here and I lose the sheet. So that one's done. smaller things around here and then I'll call this one done okay so that one's done let's go over here this page I'm gonna use these like giant hair pieces as anchors because I think they're funny ripping these there. 
Let's use some other stuff. Let's use some of these. Just really want to get these done, apparently. And there. There. this down here. Put some of the flower stuff around. Little flowers. And that one completely ripped. Okay. I feel like I'm a lot more frazzled this time than I was last time when I did this. I don't know why, but I'm frazzled. on there. Hmm. Let's see. I mean, I've got some words that could definitely be used up. This one that says smile. I'm just gonna put that right there. Put the little dot on there. Okay, now I'm gonna move on to the next page. Let's see. Let's use some of these. here. I'm fine if some of the words are covered a little, a little bit. It doesn't really bother me. So Enjoy. Don't know that it'll fit. It probably won't. I'm going to have to stagger them a bit. That's fine. Okay, now some trolls. Gotta have some trolls on here. And of course I ripped that again. It's alright, once it's down you won't really be able to tell that much. I got these stickers at the Dollar Tree. I don't know when. There. Let's put a 
pickle over here because why not? I think that's going to be it for that one. And then I'm going to use some of these big foods. Let's use a pie. And a taco. And I'll use a couple of these too as anchors. up these flowers on this side at least. Got a leafy. And well that just decided where it wanted to go all on its own. <laughs> my life thing. Really trying hard not to rip the letters. difficult. They really don't want to come off. There we go. Sweet. She's going to take this snap and put that over here. Why the heck snap? Add one more flower over here, just because just we can. Or a leaf, maybe. There we go. The leaf wanted to come off. And some more of these little circles. about the trolls. I'm so sorry, trolls. Trolls, trolls, trolls. Trolls, trolls, trolls. How many times can I say trolls? There. Can I use this hairpiece? Is it gonna, is it gonna work here? Is it gonna fit? I'm just gonna put it there. Whatever. And this long hairpiece. What am I going to do with this? I'm going to have to put it on the next page, probably. Yeah. I'm just going to go ahead and stick that, actually, right in the middle page. And that is done. That sticker is ripped, so it doesn't count. It doesn't count, okay? Let's see. I'm going to try and use up these, but I also want to use some of these large pieces. So let's use the pizza. 
and maybe a small pie. You know what? That's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna put pie on the hair. Cause why not? Right? Why? The last one, so that page is done. Yay! Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna use these last words on here, so this will finish this page off, which is awesome. This sticker sheet's been sitting around forever. A lot of these have. Best. Ever. Really not too worried about the words being super straight because the page is going to look chaotic anyway, so it's not a big deal. So now that page is done, yay! Okay, let's put some flowers. It's going to be very flower heavy. Flowers, flowers, all the flowers. There. Let's see. Mm -hmm. vellum strips and a circle and another circle I don't want to cover this up too much because I want you to still be able to tell that it's pizza and this page is done that page is stickers <laughs> I mean I mean, I think this page is pretty, pretty much done also. But let's stick a pickle somewhere. I really want to put a pickle there. Pickle for you, a pickle for you. Okay, now I'll call that done. Okay. So this page is finished. That took way longer than I expected it to. Pretty sure that took me like half an hour. <laughs> but that's okay. So this is the completed part one awesome so that's it if you're interested in staying staying what if you're interested in seeing the rest of these stay tuned for part two that's what i was gonna say anyway that's it thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video if you did go ahead and give it a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you next time bye